All right, hey, we are trying something a little ambitious this time around. We're going to show you basically 14,000 pictures. Right now what I've got going on is a slower version like of some of just random pictures. I looked at the thumbnails. I was like, I'm going to grab this one, this one, this one. This shows off my trip. This was a 35-day road trip. 14,000 pictures were taken. I'm gonna sh this is a slow version. Then stick around for the second song and uh, some more pictures. Very fast. It's meant really to be a super teaser. You're not watching this to see all the pictures. You're watching this to get an idea of the road trip and the locations I went to. Yeah, you're gonna see them fly by at the end. Okay, um, since we're gonna see most of the pictures a little bit later, I'm gonna talk about the locations I went, and I'm gonna try to do it as fast as I can. But I'd like to give a shout out to Mayday Red, who let me use this first song, and then the second song is by Aaron Hatch, or Big Fresh Mo. I hope I'm saying that right. I'll look for their information, put it on uh, the YouTube information and link them. So, anyways, uh, I hope you're enjoying this first uh, rundown and take a look for the um, the music only version if you don't want to hear me talking and kind of screaming out little, like I was here, I was here, I was here. 35 day road trip again, 14,000 pictures. Uh, it was a lot of fun, did a lot of things, focused a lot on night stuff. I focused, And then I hung out with a lot of really cool photographers and other friends. And I uh, went through Idaho and then uh, spent a bunch of time in Oregon and a lot of time in California and then finished it off in southern Utah. Are we ready for fast? This is fast. I started off in Draper, Utah, where I did some pictures of the temple. And then after that, I drove up to Logan, Utah, stayed with a friend there and did pictures in the morning. And then I drove all the way to Boise, Idaho. And here we are in Boise, Idaho, and did, did pictures of the temple there. And the next morning, I tried to get all the way to my parents' house in Oregon, but didn't get that far and went and did some pictures of myself in random sand dunes. Did some pictures of my sister here. And then I went and visited friends and our family in Klamath Falls and then went to Medford, Oregon and took pictures of the temple and then hung out with my brother's family for Christmas. And then, whew, I'm already ahead. And then I did pictures of my brother's family. So these are some family pictures that I did there. And then uh, later that day, I went out with my br my nephews and we went snowshoeing. Look, I'm already ahead. So here's us snowshoeing. And then later that night, we did some like light up stuff and did wait, late at night. Then I went to Portland, Oregon and hung out with my friend Dev Graham. And he did some video, and I did some photography all around town with his father. He took us to a bunch of different places, and then we ended at the skyline or the, around the beach, and then or the beach, the river. That was the temple there in Portland. This is Mount Shasta, um, and this is some random place in California where I woke up in the morning and just shot. And then I drove through the cool hills and then made it to Sutro Baths in San Francisco, hang out with some people the next morning. Ta-da! We're at the wedding that I was hired to go do in San Francisco. So we did the getting ready stuff, and then um, lots of pictures of the bride and her details and the fun jewelry that she had. And then we got to ride in the Google bus. We went to Chrissy Field and took some fam or group pictures and some couple pictures. And then you know threw in some bride pictures there, and some more group pictures with her uh, bridal party. Now we're to the location. This is at the uh, Bentley Reserve in San Francisco, and we had the, the, the ceremony, some group pictures. Now we're getting to the reception area, and you're going to see a bunch of fun stuff. And this is a fun uh, song called Dangerous. Uh, the last one you listened to was Stratosphere by Mayday Red, and this is Dangerous by Big, uh, Big Fresh Smoke. I don't think I'm saying that wrong, right? Anyways, did some Jarvie windows at the wedding, and uh, these, by the way, if you haven't noticed, these are all unedited. There were a few, maybe 20 or 30 at the beginning that were edited. The rest of the 14,000, unedited. Okay, so, and then I went and did Sacramento Temple, and then now this is Oakland Temple, the next day after that, and then this is another day, um, and this 
was, that was San Francisco, and then to Half Moon Bay with Robert Scoble, and then back up to San Francisco with a photo walk, a long exposure photo walk. So the next three days are that. So this was the evening, and this is the next morning with Joe Azur, and we, uh, and then I, we joined up with the group and did some downtown stuff, and then finished the day up. I went to uh, this beach, Baker Beach, I believe it's called. And then uh, this is the next morning, more with lots of people. This actually, this is the third and final day, and I hung out with a lot of people. Uh, this Brandy Green met her and spent a bunch of time with her that day, and took a bunch of pictures of her, and then with all the rest of the people there. And we drove up the coast to St. Reyes, and and uh, here we are. And this is the sunset. Well, this is more Brandy, and then and then we did sunset at St. Point Reyes Beach. And there's a lot of photographers. There was like, I don't know, 40, 50 photographers. So we're hanging out with them, doing night stuff, doing some Jarvie window stuff, get dinner. Um, yes, and then uh, we tried to do it with that boat. was really cool. San Francisco the next morning with Brandy. And then I drove down the coast. And this is uh, Central Coast, right from Beach. And I stayed around after all the other photographers had gone. I did some night stuff there. The next morning at that waterfall into the Central Coast, Central California Coast, seals and vultures, zebras, and more like water type stuff, Pismo Beach here. And then um, that was the next morning, and then I made it to Los Angeles for sunset, took pictures of the temple there, and then woke up in New Beach, and then took, like took pictures of the temple there. Then it was a long haul to go all the way to uh, Death Valley, and then pictures the next morning. And then uh, this is where I started uh, about three or four days in Death Valley, hung out with Roma and Natalia. And we went to the racetrack, uh, we did sunset, and then we did sunrise. Well, we did night stuff and then sunrise. And um, then we went to I did some of the dunes from afar, and then we went to Zabrinsky Point and took pictures of that. It's called the Manly Beacon. Some time lapse here, um, and some star stuff with some lighting. And then uh, near Badwater, which is called Flats area, did some 360 panoramas. You know, some really rich panoramas. We were with uh, Luke as well, and then we grew, joined up with another group and did some more locations in the Badwater area. And then at this old abandoned mine, if we were trying to to get there, I did this like stop motion kind of little video. We went back to the sand dunes for more night stuff, and then we drove to Joshua Tree. So we were in Joshua Tree for some night stuff, some Joshua Tree stuff, some desert, desert looking type thing. Then I made it to Las Vegas. And did some pictures there, so including some panoramas, and then went to St. George and did some more collectible pictures there in St. George. And then it was a long haul through Zion National Park all the way to the Moab region, and then I did a night photo session with a couple of photographers there. And then here we are with, I was at a Devin Graham video, and though we can't show all the pictures from that, um, I'm showing a bunch of the ones that we can, including lots of the people that went. And then I hung out with a uh, photographer, just, well, a friend, just stay and then we did a few things the next day but this is still actually all the other uh, college age kids that came down from Devin's video we're hanging out and doing things and now we're actually getting to the point where I went to just stay in Canyonlands and then the next morning we went to Arches National Park in the Windows area and did some pictures there to rest it a little bit and came back in the evening well, and I did an engagement pictures for my friend Janine and Colton. And so here are all their engagement pictures that we did for our arches. And then, um, yep, a bunch more, lots of locations. I'm sure there's going to be a video of just these pictures, a little bit slower. And then more pictures of arches that night. And then I went back the next morning and did some more. So this is a nice, my final, final morning. And then I drove out this cool route out of Moab. And then Manti, Utah, and did sunset there, and that is it, ladies and gentlemen. Hope you enjoyed it. That was 14,000 pictures, and uh, yeah, enjoy.